Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we've got one goal in mind and that's to take blackjack and jump it over this little mound here. We're gonna do it so stay tuned. So what we've got to try first is a couple of test runs. At first we thought we would go this way and come up. I think that's a little bit too steep of an angle because of how much overhang this front bumper has in front of the tires. Then we decided at some point maybe we would start, start way at the top of the hill and come down. But when we lifted off this little knoll, same idea. I thought maybe it would be too much of a nosedive for the car. And the goal here is to be able to drive this car home, hopefully. Worst case, we got to go get the trailer and uh, take it home if we break something, but we're not breaking anything today. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to try a few test runs. We're going to back it up way over here and we're going to take a few at different speeds to see what we're going to need to get that up off the ground. And like I said, the goal is to get all four tires off the ground at the same time. I've got a camera over here stationary to see if that's going to happen. We've got Junior over here with another camera and you guys will be with me inside the car as we do this daring jump. Now again, one of the things I forgot today was a helmet, but I think we'll totally be fine. Yeah, Junior's saying yes. So let me move my coffee and uh, we'll make a few test runs here. All right, so we can put our seat belts on for safety. And then we gotta get this car turned around. Whew. Okay, so we are backed up on this hill Junior's way over there, we get the cameras going, and uh, we're going to make an attempt here to see what kind of speed we're going to need to get off the ground. Let's do it. All right, so we're going to try and do this with me holding the camera and getting some speed at the same time. Let's let her rip. stop the freeze frame right here. As you can see the two front tires are off the ground but I don't think the back one's quite made. <laughs> Running came off the ground a bit. Did it? All right so more speed. Still need a little bit more speed. Right there yeah just more speed. Okay it perfect. Looked, the suspension didn't look perfect like it didn't I heard, I heard the rear axle come down, like it must have been real close to bottoming out, like as far as dropping too far. Yeah, I so, just need a bit more speed. A little bit more speed. You know, it there, it. Not really flooring it, no, I didn't want to come all the way. So Junior says we've got to try that, the same thing, just a little bit more speed, so we may have to back up a little bit more. That ground is very, very rocky, and uh, it's hard because it's all loose, and it's like stones, not just sand or gravel. So they're all over the place. We're gonna try and get a little bit more speed. Uh, and hopefully we do it on this uh, second go and then we can go home because it's, it's getting chilly out here. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna try it uh, for a second attempt. Let's see if we can make it happen. Anyways, traction control is off and we're just gonna kind of ease down this hill and let's make it happen. tire I think is off the ground. <laughs> she was squirrely. <laughs> that looked pretty good. Did it? Oh yeah. We'll have to check the footage. She was real squirrely. Oh I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> so of those two test runs we've come to the conclusion that we are getting air. It's hard to see with the eye. But when we reviewed the footage, we are actually getting air. Because if you look here, this is your traction tire. And it stops kind of breaking traction and just barely glides over the snow right here. This is your front tire right here. It leaves the ground. You can see there's no tire tread in front of it. And then it comes all the way up here and it's touching down right here again. And if we come over here, we're doing the same thing. We've got the right front wheel, the tire, the tread leaves the ground right there and it hits back down here again. 
So I think we're really, really close to making this happen. Maybe we're gonna try it one more time and try and get a little bit more speed and not try and get so squirrely uh, because I was losing a little bit of control. That rear end just wanted to fishtail out from behind me. So we're gonna try it one more time. Uh, Junior's got the camera. I've got one over here. We're gonna hit record. We're gonna get this one more time. All right, seatbelt. Safety first when you're doing stupid stuff. We are gonna try this one more time. See if we can make it happen. Same. Oh, same. So what you're saying is we gotta try it one more time. You gotta try it one more time. See the problem is is that if I get the extra speed coming down the hill, what's happening is by the time I hit the bottom, the weight of the car is coming down and that's what's getting the car loose. So Well honestly your first your first one was one of the better ones. The second one was pretty good too. Alright, well try it one more time. I'm gonna try and get down like this a little bit and see if we can't do this one more time. I'm gonna face you guys out this way this time. How's that sound? Same thing. Yep. Although the front end came off the ground more that time. Did it? Yeah. Well. I think it's just that you can't catch traction. I think that's exactly what it is. Um, you're, it looks like you're spinning the whole way. Well, I am. And if I turn traction control on, I'll just lose power. Too much power of this 4.6. Too much power in this old car. Um, yeah. Well, I think we've got one more attempt in it, guys. And if it doesn't do it after that, well, we're just gonna have to call it that we cannot get airtime the way that we're going at it here right now. Anyways, we'll try one more time. You think it come over this way a little bit more? It looks just a tad bit steeper here. It kind of does, doesn't it? Why don't we do that? Like, just get your, like, get, like, the middle of the car, like, right here. Like, come up right here. Well, got nothing to lose. We'll try moving it over a little bit. See how that works. So this time the plan is, rather than go up here where we've been going, we're going to come over here a little bit more. Because it does seem like it's a little bit more steep and a little bit more of a little edge on it. So, let's try this this time. where that left rear tire wasn't touching the ground. Woo! I think we did it that time. <laughs> oh, I love a rear wheel drive car. It was better, but it's still back in. It's the back end getting off the ground that you gotta do. It's the front end that's supposed to be coming. Yeah, well. As much as I hate to say it, I think we've been defeated. So, to be continued for sure, because I think what we're gonna end up having to do is possibly come back out here or find a better spot sometime that we can take advantage of these, these mounds out here because I think there's a, a lot of potential. We just gotta get enough running uh, space to get up a little bit more speed to do so. You could have another five, 10 kilometers to that. It wouldn't, it wouldn't take a whole lot, I don't think. We just don't have the space. Anyways, we're gonna call this one good. Uh, 
go back, review the footage. We'll edit everything up so you guys get to see each jump. Um, and uh, we'll slow them down a little bit for slow motion so we can see those tires coming off the ground. And you never know. So I'll close out this video once I've got everything edited and we'll see where we are. So as you guys saw when I got everything all edited, we managed to get three out of the four tires off the ground. So we've got a little bit more work to do. We need a little bit more speed to get up over those mounds and uh, we're gonna keep practicing. We're gonna make sure that we do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, something a little out of the ordinary and uh, we're, you know, we're gonna be doing some more beating on uh, old blackjack here in the near future again. We're gonna try and make sure we get some good quality content for you guys. If you haven't done so already, please, hit that like button, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you wanna see more action on Project Blackjack because we're gonna be doing a lot more to it. Don't forget the Car Guy and Six Fan Show is Thursday evenings coming up on January the 7th and it's gonna be premiering on Grant Tommy's channel who is Straight Six Fan. I'm gonna leave a link right up here. You guys can go over and check his channel out. Hopefully you'll subscribe. That way you'll get notified when we go live on Thursday evenings at seven o'clock central, eight Eastern and nine local time. Guys, stay focused on the windshield, not the rearview mirror. I love you all. God bless. Let's do it again real soon.